All right, time now for the top 10 plays of the week in our NBA TV countdown. Starting at 10 is Stephon Marbury's sweet pass for Dikembe Mutombo. Oh, what a pass from Marbury, handled by Mutombo. He likes a little sugar, too. In at number nine is the Maverick Steve Nash as he shakes and bakes his way past the bull. Nash with a nifty move as he shook Heinrich, and Steve wants the foul. At number eight is the Pacers' Al Harrington, who hits his receiver with a long touchdown pass. Good Harrington, Good and there's O'Neal, and he carries the ball, and I'm sure Tony Dungy enjoyed that one as Harrington throws it into the end zone. At seven, a quick turnaround as the Nets stop a Celtic break and start one of their own. Right to Richard Jefferson. Jefferson is in the right spot. Big time monster dunk. Checking at number six, the man who has beaten many a buzzer, Reggie Miller, does it again. Pass the buzzer. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> for Reggie Miller. They'll look at the replay. At five, center Marcus Camby shows flashy ball handling isn't just for the little guy. Marcus Camby, he's been in the wrong position all these years. He's a point guard. At four is the Hornets' Daryl Armstrong with a long range heat. And he gets it into Armstrong, who fires it up and scores. Daryl Armstrong fired it up for a three pointer off the glass. Into number three, it's Marcus Camby again, this time taking it himself. Over to Marcus Camby, he'll take that for right, go to the hoop and slam it down. Oh, Marcus Camby, took the dust out of the net on that one. At two, the Bucks' Tony Kukoc to Desmond Mason, who comes flying through the back door. As, oh. oh, my goodness. They were all up dancing on the baseline. For the number one play of the week, the Bucks' Michael Red had the Spurs seeing red with this incredible play. The oh, cross is over! And oh, starts oh, a beautiful yes. crossover. And then at the last, had to make a great move with his body. That's our show for this week. Last week, fans on NBA.com agreed with us that this LeBron James reverse layup was the number one play of the week, and it's worth another look. Also, you can get all the information on the recent Boston Celtics coaching change by logging on to NBA.com. <laughs>